Hey everybody, this video is on how to buy a shipping container. I'm here in Blue Line down in Miami where they have a lot of shipping containers that are that are right here. They are moving some around so uh, to prepare for uh, sales tomorrow. They've already sold these three but also they want to get a couple of those two up top for me to look at and, and make sure that that they're good ones and, and uh, hopefully I will buy one today. And that's the first tip I want to say is that I am here, I am in person and I am actually looking at, touching, feel, feeling, opening the doors up and checking out the actual shipping container that I will be buying. So if you're buying a shipping container, there's a lot, a lot of scammers online, a whole lot. There's a lot of brokers, there's a lot of middlemen, but my advice is go and pick one out yourself. And that's hard to do. It's hard to find a place that you can walk in, look at the container, see it, touch it, and interact with it. But that is really what you want to be doing. Then you know they're real, they're not a scammer, you're cutting out the middleman, and you're just a lot safer when you can actually see the product, see the container, and you're good to go. Second thing to watch out for is a lot of the scammers, they're going to want Zelle or some kind of online payment that you cannot reverse. Um, so you want to pay with, with a credit card, then you have some recourse if, uh, if they never show up with the container because it's a credit card so you can dispute it through your credit card. And a lot of scammers are not going to take a credit card because they're scammers and they just want to take your money for you and not give you the product. Um, so here I can pay with a credit card. There is a there is a three percent fee if I choose to do that. Um, I can also pay uh, here with cash on delivery because they're their drivers. It's their drivers. They own the drivers. So cash on delivery works too. And then again, you know you're not getting scanned because you don't pay a damn thing until the actual container shows up like it's supposed to at your location. So we, uh, we got burned. We had a hard time finding uh, shipping containers and finding ones that we could go see. So we went with what looked like a legitimate business and it was a legitimate business. It's just the legitimate business was not the scammers that were saying they were that legitimate business. They just used somebody else's legitimate business and, and they got us for a bit. Uh, and that really sucks. So a lot of the stuff you see on Facebook a lot of that marketing and that advertising, man, if you cannot go see the containers and check them out, don't do it. Don't do it. So I'm going to be looking at uh, some of those top two containers over there. There's one down there that I like too, but he's like, hey, those are probably just as good. We'll put them on the ground and you can check them out. Um, I'm going to look, make sure they're nice and straight. I'm going to make sure the door is easy to open uh, for my girl uh, and for me and there it is it's physically there they're moving around for me right now and i'll be paying in a way that's safe uh either a credit card or or on delivery so i know i'm getting what i'm paying for and i'm not getting not getting scammed here i hope this is helpful uh it is hard to find places like this but uh if you look you can find them this is blue line down to miami hopefully there's something like this that's near you and uh, you know, they're treating me right here and I can actually see the product that I'll be buying and there'll be an invoice with it and uh, it's fairly safe and fairly secure. All right, that's about all I have to say. Take care everybody, stay safe.